a bad little build that. Well, I should be on my way to Donnanook in Tramper Van today. Which, uh, Tramper Van, it failed MOT dismally. There was a lot of work on it, a lot of welding, and uh, ain't not back up road till January. Plus, Kaz, uh, she's fell in love with the dog at this rescue centre. <laughs> so, uh, we'll have to see that 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. So I've ended up down Camp Stupid, chilling out here, I come straight from work like yesterday. Uh, threw it down with rain last night. 
So I'm just going to chill out around here for a couple of days and uh, see what happens. Well, I've still got all this netting left from uh, from when I had teepee when I took it down. Uh, it's all uh, tied together. But so what I've been doing, I've been like taking it apart bit by bit, cutting it to size, and making some uh, some hammock chairs. Uh, it all depends on what size it's coming off. The, I mean, this is an ideal for an hammock chair. This is. I'll give this a go in a bit. Uh, there's a lot to go at and <laughs> it's just started raining again well there it goes I've got every faith in that blue rope and every faith in this netting Well, I'm going to attempt some of that Hunter's chicken, my own recipe. I think it's uh, chicken, barbecue sauce, uh, bacon and cheese. So I'm going to have some mushrooms and uh, onions. It's absolutely throwing it down. But I don't want to get a, a tarp up because I've got an early start tomorrow. So I'm just uh, making do this little canopy here. I'll we'll fry onions, take mushrooms down, they're well done. Uh, Ginger left some uh, tin taters down here. I'm going to boil them up and then I might give them a bit of a fry, the uh, mushrooms. I think that potatoes, mushrooms, onions, and now I'm in some barbecue sauce.
and uh, put it over your chicken. Add bacon. Add cheese. Get it wrapped up. Put back in fire. That is gorgeous. Barbecued Hunter's chicken. Hope floor's gradually going. Uh, been hammering it down the rain, getting quite muddy. And uh, I'm burning floor, I'm burning floor out of there. Uh, been doing dinner and that on it. It's, uh, don't stop. So, I'm gonna chill out. I'm gonna get in there. Oh uh, yeah. Hot coffee rum. Listen to rain and the cracking of the fire. Uh, morning. Well, I've just had a phone call from the wife. I'm overlaid. Uh, <laughs> it's half past eight. We've got my there for ten. Uh, it's going to be a quick pack up, and uh, we're going to have a look at this dog. Uh, see you later. Well, I made it in time to the dog rescue centre. The wife's all made up. And uh, they've let us have the dog on day release. What, are, what is it called, Kaz? Angus. Well, the dog's called Angus. He's just over, uh, just over a year old. We see now he's getting on with Fred. Uh, we're going to chance him off at Lee. Look, he's a bit of a staghound. But uh, we'll see how we get on. We're going to walk through the woods. And, uh, well, well, we'll see how it goes. Well, here he is. Angus. He's got some staghound in him. <laughs> he's a bit timid. Uh, the wife's fell in love with him. Fred don't know what to make on him. Fred. Anyway, uh, we've had him how long? Half hour. Half hour. Well, he's only on day release anyway. We're gonna we're gonna let him off, and we're gonna go against all all the rules Friends. and see if we can get him back. A uh, bit of a timid dog he is, but uh, right there. Let the dog off the lead. This is where everything goes to shit. <laughs> <laughs> and there he's gone. Look, never to be seen again. Come on, Angus. Come on, Angus. Oh, so far so good. Well, I don't know what we're only setting for. They're both, uh, I don't know what they're rolling in.
Well, I brought the bloody thing down to Camp Stupid. And, uh, well, it seems to like it down here.